Hey guys, how's it going? So I'm going to be lightening my hair today with the vitamin C wash and you will see how it looks right now. Alright, so this is how it turned out. I do feel like it lightened it some. It didn't lighten it a lot, but it lightened it some and I feel like it gave it a more strawberry look to it, which is great. Um, so this is what I did. I got 40 of the 1000 milligram vitamin C tablets. I put it in my magic bullet ground it, grinded it, ground it, whatever, until it became a fine powder, put it in my mixing bowl that I got from Sally's, and I mixed just enough shampoo t until it was like a slimy mixture. It was stringy and slimy and like snot-like. I also made sure I got a dye-free shampoo. The only dye-free shampoo I could really find was Pantene Pro-V. Now, if you remember the Prell was what I used last time and my ends turned green. This time using the dye free shampoo, as you see, my ends are not green. It actually probably was the dye. So after I mixed it, I applied it on my hair and I massaged it into my hair really well, making sure I got it everywhere. And then I left a bag on it and that took a total of 30 minutes. I consider leaving it in for another like five to 10 minutes because while I like this, like I wouldn't mind it being just like a hair lighter, but if I remember correctly from the last uh, vitamin C wash video, after the 25, 30 minute mark, my hair was done lightening it. It was as light as it would go. And so I think this is light as it, as it would have gone even if I had held it in my hair for another 10 minutes or so. So I like how it turned out. I am going to keep it for the moment until I find until I find that red dye. I've been looking up some of the red dyes that you guys have uh, requested for me to try. Some of them have been discontinued, which stinks because they are gorgeous colors. Um, some of them I feel like they don't ship at all to the U.S., which also stinks. And I'm trying to think that. Oh yeah. So when I washed out my hair, I washed, of course, it all out, and then I used my regular Suave Professionals shampoo, lather that in, wash that out, then put in my Suave Professionals conditioner, and I left that in for a while, and then washed that out with cold water. That was something that was advised for me to do, and I'm really glad I did. It was mentioned that the vitamin C opens the shafts in your hair to help like lighten it or to remove the dye, and putting the cold water on it will help close it back up. And I'm, and I noticed that doing that, my hair felt much softer afterwards as well. I have right now in it a um, Cantu leave-in conditioner. I'm kind of using it as a mousse to add that moisture back in and to help use it to define the waves in my hair. I've been doing that a lot lately. I've been worried about the ends of my hair. You know, I I might need to trim them, but I have been wanting to give it back that nourishment that I know has been stripped from it with all the bleaching and the lifting and the everything that I've been doing to the ends. So I've been using it like after I wash my hair and when I style it, I've been putting it in on my ends. So um, that is it. If you guys have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Thank you all for watching. I'll catch you on the flip. Bye guys. So I watched a video yesterday, last night, of a gal who dyed her hair ginger and it was this beautiful like copper ginger color. And she was like, don't ever do the vitamin C wash. Don't ever do it. And I was like, oh. <laughs> well, too bad. I've already decided to do the vitamin C wash. But she was saying on her channel how she didn't like the vitamin C wash and she thought it was probably bad for your hair. And she said, just use um, anti-dandruff shampoo. And I'm like, oh, I won't be using head and shoulders. I don't want anything that's like super stripping because I feel like the vitamin C is already stripping it. She's like, if you want to strip your hair, just use the anti-dandruff shampoo. And I'm like, well... <laughs> Too bad I've already uh, committed to the vitamin C wash.